photo. All right, so let's step into Photoshop. And um, this is the first video I'm doing in 2023. And so I'm, I'm really glad to be back. Okay, so we are going to use, um, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's use, um, let's go to new, okay. And then let's just create this. Let's set here to 2000. Now, you guys know, I like to keep the resolution quite high so that, you know, it's going to look um quite quality you see so 2000 here 2000 here 300 here and then let's click on create and then let's go here um, let's go to view and then let's click on new card layout all right now set here to four click over here set here to four as well we don't really need this one so let's click on zero type zero here as well and then the margin um let's give the margin like that all right click on okay okay so now our canvas is divided nicely into this grid all right so now let's click on the move tool this is quite easy very easy to create such a mock-up okay so let's just drag um this image in there like that and just let's leave it here like that okay and then let's uh, hold shift and then alt at the same time and then reduce it like that all right okay all right so let's reduce it even more okay now this is great all right this i think this is great okay so come down here and then create a new layer under it all right pick your brush to come here select color black and then make sure it is a soft round brush if you can't find out just click on general brushes over here and choose soft round brush the hardness to zero the opacity and then the flow to 100 each and then just increase the brush size and then click over here one uh, you know click is good just transform it and then just do it like this and just bring it down here like that okay all right so you can see what i'm doing it. now another click on your move to another thing you can do is control t and then right click it and then click on warp okay that way you can pull the portion up Right. so it's basically like playing with it until you get what you really want control t all right now let's go there again let's make it much more exactly something like that okay so now i think this is great control j to duplicate it control t and then right click it and then flip horizontal now you can drag it this way as well and guys you're done like like just like that you are done with it you can tweak it a little bit you know make sure the all fall in the middle of the <laughs> you know all right make sure the all fall here you can do it like that but it all depends on you okay so let's bring this one let's look at how it looks like all right now, and an and interesting thing is that you can put it all in a group and then control t and then resize it all right it's amazing right and then you can also go here over here make sure you right click it and then convert to smart object that way you can double click it all right and then um go and pick any let me see which of my work i have done so far i don't want to use anybody's work ignite global um which of my work have i done so far let me pick let me pick this and drag it in there and then release it here like that okay maybe let me just resize it more okay enter and then control s to save it now that you save i can close it this way and automatically it reflects over here as well all right guys so if you love this video please hit the bell icon and subscribe to this channel i am back i love you all guys remember to follow me just just click on the subscribe button so i don't miss any other tutorial that i i, I 
bring on this channel i love you all guys see you in the next video peace